comment that I saw. Um, yeah, this is how you export, not import, export things from Roblox Studio. So let me import a part. I'm going to customize this part so you know that this is something that I made when I export it. Okay, this is my creation. I select it. Eh, it kind of makes a J. So you select it, you right click, you see all these options, you go export selection. Then I'm on Mac, so you can see this stuff, but if you're on um, Windows, it'd be pretty much the same. You choose where you want to save it. I'm gonna put it on the desktop. Let's name this J test and then save. And then you exported it from Roblox and then insert object mesh part. So this is a mesh part. These are parts. This is a mesh part, it's a separate thing. So then you can import go to where you saved your creation select said creation import you'll probably get that troubleshooting and whatnot message that I just got there's nothing wrong with your thing but then here's the creation this is not a bunch of parts anymore see if you do this with a part it all goes together this is a mesh part so it's like you can change the scale like that. This is also different from a union because if you select the union, union, this still acts like all the parts. Mesh part, completely different thing. But that is how you export from Roblox Studio. Like and subscribe and whatnot.